Okay, hi everyone. Have you all well and you have been staying focused in your training or literally staying focused in yourself most importantly and trying to kind of get a routine as much as you possibly can and give yourself some space as well uh, whether you're going out running. So I know a lot of people now are out running which is really, really, really good uh, and I just hope that continues. I know the weather's not particularly great this week but the most important thing is if, it's, if it is really raining, we don't want to go out running, let's do some kind of activity at home or some recovery work. So I thought I'd show you this morning just a sort of ankle mobility and then calf stretching plus help lengthening the calves, get the tension out, especially down through the calf and the Achilles and help mobilize the ankle a bit more so it gets a little bit locked because it when we run and stiff. So I'm just going to show you one very, very basic. So I think you just about see my foot. So what I want to do is, I know my foot's a bit higher, but I'm trying to make sure my foot is on a flat floor. I want to find where I can keep my heel down and I can push money forward. I can easily do that. So what I want to do is challengingly, I want to push my heel back where I can just about get my knee to touch the wall. So just do this near a wall or a hard surface where you can. And I've got one knee on the floor. Okay, so it's relaxed. And I'm going to try to, so just about there for me where I can keep my heel down. So that would mean that the calf is quite tight and um, obviously trying to lengthen the calf where it attaches above the knee and down through the Achilles underneath the heel and I'm trying to lengthen that okay so if we lengthen it we're stretching aren't we taking tension out so, so most importantly what you could do is put your hand so my right hands up uh, right knees up right hand on top of the knee your left hand come underneath just to hold that heel down from there I just want to breathe out and push through so I'm just trying to push through so I can easily do that so I can take the heel back a tad then that's hard for me so just about that's my range so i'm keeping the heel down just about touch that's what i want to work on so if i can push through help lengthen that calf let's take the tension out of the calf also what we can do we can actually move the knee in so we can push in and that helps the mobility on the outside of the ankle so I push in that really helps lengthen that and helps lengthen the calf go where you can obviously i'll be touching the wall with my knee hold the heel down and then I can go forward again and then from there I can go to the outside so I'm coming right in that inside now pushing it out and it stretches more inside the ankle I'm trying to mobilize the ankle and lengthen the calf at the same time so it's a good one to do before you go running to help lengthen and help mobilize the ankle to warm them up get the joint moving better and then especially after as well you could do that and then you can work on the range see what it's like and then stretch your calves as normal, you know, standing calf stretch, laying calf stretch with a band, which I've shown you before. So I thought I'd show you this one. A lot of people are out running now, and you know, a lot of our members are out running, which is brilliant. But they're saying their calves are getting tight, their ankles are getting locked. So I just, just thought I'd show you this one. This is quite a good one to do, quite really easy, as long as you're making sure the heel stays down and you're pushing through the knee to the wall, and the heel always stays down. So you've got to find your range where you can just about push that knee forward, brush the wall with that heel staying down. I hope you uh, give that one a go. Let me know what it feels like. Let me know what happens. So if you did it a couple of times a week, two or three times a week, fill the range to start with. Mark it off on, on the floor. Or keep an eye on where it is, where your toes are, so you know your range. And then see what it's like at the end of the week. Give it a go and see if the range has improved. Good way for progression. Thank you very much. I hope you have a nice day. Um, enjoy yourself and just stay safe, everyone, okay? Most importantly, we are here to help you if you need to. So we've got 20 day challenge. Come along, try, see how we can help you for our small group uh, fitness rooms. See how we can help you start a new tradition in our uh, fitness areas where you will be um, looked after bespokely. And most importantly, in with a team that will keep you motivated. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Mike Hartz, Have a Fitness. Take care. See you soon. Bye bye.